from Daily Forex. This is Chris taking a look at the S&P 500 and the NASDAQ 100. And as you can see, we initially tried to rally, but then gave back a bit of the gains. Uh, at this point, uh, 4,200 is an area that I think a lot of people will pay attention to. Uh, but if we break down below there, then we have the 50-day EMA and what I consider to be uh, 4,000. I, I think that's your floor. Breaking below that has me buying puts. With the Fed coming out with an announcement late on Wednesday, I think that's what we have seen here in the NASDAQ as well. We've dropped down in the NASDAQ 100 to 14,000. I think any pullback will probably be bought into as soon as the Federal Reserve reassures Wall Street that it has its back. 13,000 should be a floor. 13,500 should also be supportive. I just don't short U.S. indices. The Fed is far too manipulative if we were to fall, say, 10%. They'll come in and say something in the middle of the day and cause a short covering uh, stampede. So I'm looking for an opportunity to buy. I don't read too much into this candlestick other than people are trying to get out of the way of the announcement.